Okay, now we are going to solve problem from Krasik Advanced Engineering Mathematics problem 1.1. There is 20 question on problem 1.1, but I will try to first for first four questions first and let's see if we can continue this until all question is solved. So the question is solve this by integration and let's do the first one. The question is y prime plus 2 sine 2 pi x is equal to 0. Okay, we can move this to the right hand side. So y prime is equal to minus 2 sine 2 pi x. And here y prime we can write it as dy over dx. So I will have this one. And I can separate them. So I will get dy is equal to minus 2 sine 2 pi x dx. And we can integrate both sides. So I will get here minus 2 integral sine 2 pi x dx. So I will have y equal to minus 2 and here integral of sine is minus cos and because here is 2 pi x so I will get this and over 2 pi plus some constant okay so what can we do here y is equal to 1 over pi cos 2 pi x minus 2 constant and this minus 2 constant is we can also write it as let's Let's make it C1. So I will have 1 over pi cos 2 pi x plus this is also constant. Let's just name it constant 2. And this is the answer for problem number 1. Okay, let's erase this and let's try to answer problem number 2. Okay, from problem number 2, I will get this y prime plus x e to the minus x squared over 2 is equal to 0 and let's move this to the right hand side so I will have minus x e to the minus x squared over 2 is equal to 0 and let's write it as this one dy dx minus x minus squared over 2 uh, this is not equal to 0 sorry and okay what can we do here let's move this dx to the right hand side minus x e minus x squared over 2 dx and we can integrate both sides so I will get y and integral minus x e to the minus x squared over 2 dx okay here yeah. so to integrate this I will need to do u substitution let's u is equal to minus x squared divided by 2 then we will have du is equal to minus minus yeah minus x dx so i will get here y is equal to integral this minus x dx is equal to du and this will be e to the u du so i will have this as 
e to the u plus some constant let's just say it. and because u is this one so i will have y is equal to e to the minus x squared divided by 2 plus c1 so this is the answer for question number two okay let's erase this and let's move on to question number three so for question number three we will have y prime is equal to y and i move all the y to the left hand side so let's just write it as this dy dx and this y is become 1 over y and to the right hand side is equal to 1 or I can write this as dy over y is equal to dx let's integrate both sides so I will have integral this and integral this so integral of 1 over y dy is natural log of y and integral of dx is x and this is plus some constant c1 or we can just write this as y is equal to e and here x plus c1 or we can write this as e to the x and e to the c1 and this c1 is a constant so i will let's name this as c2 so i will have the solution of this is y is equal to c2 e to the x this is for question number three okay let's stop at number three and let's move on to question number four for question number four i get y prime is equal to minus 1.5 y and again we can write this as dy dx is equal to minus 1.5 y and i can move all the y to the left hand side and all the x to the right hand side so i will get dy over y is equal to minus 1.5 dx and i can integrate both sides so i will get integral dy over y is equal to minus 1.5 integral dx so here i will have learn y and on the right hand side i will have 1.5 x plus some constant number one okay so we will have this and we can write this as y is equal to e minus 1.5 x plus c1 okay let's do some simplification so this is e minus 1.5 x and e minus 1.5 c1 and this is this part is a constant and let's name this as c2 so i will have that y is equal to e i mean c2 e to the 1.5 x and this is the answer for question number four okay it's done for this video let's continue in other video thank you